So if you clicked on this video, you're trying to figure out how to order metal. Well, this is how I do it. I'm getting right to show you how. Stay tuned. Hey y'all, welcome to the channel. Today we're gonna to talk about ordering metal for your project, your small welding business, whatever you have, okay? And part one to order metal is figure out exactly what you need. So we're working on this here budget trailer from a buddy of mine. It's a Lowe's five by eight. Basically what we're doing is we're going in and putting supports in the trailer because it's a very minimal trailer. They put the minimum amount of metal in it to cut down on the cost and the weight to get it out the door. So we need to reinforce it. We're gonna order some metal and I'm gonna show you the process on how to do it. The first process, the first part of the process is figuring out exactly what you need. So you're gonna need your tape measure and you're gonna measure out exactly your cuts that you need to make to figure out the total length. That'll give you an idea of how much metal you need to order. So the trailer itself on the main, on the main section of the trailer is two by two angle, one eighth inches thick. Back here on the tailgate, we have one and a half by one and a half inches by one eighth inch thick. So, instead of ordering two different pieces, two different thicknesses of metal, we're just gonna go with the one and a half by one and a half. That way it fits in here and it fits under there, under the main part of the trailer, giving it support, but it also cuts down one on the weight, two in the amount of space we take up underneath the trailer. There's gonna be a tight fitting spot right here by the axle we'll get to in another video. So when I say figure up the total length that you need, what I mean by that is every cut I'm gonna do, I need to go ahead and count for it. So in between each section, I need to get my measurements, each section, everywhere I'm gonna put something. Then I'm gonna add that up for a total amount of inches. Now when I call and place my order, he's gonna tell me how long my stick of metal is. A stick is a, is a piece that normally comes in 20 to 24 foot sections. So I need to figure out the total amount of inches that I need for this project and figure how many sticks I need, okay? And we're gonna move on to step two inside. So we'll move on in and follow me. Metal order. So step two, getting the metal order, calling the supplier. Over here to my left, I have my laptop. All you need to do is Google metal supplier. I'm not talking about tractor supply, I'm not talking about average supply. They charge you what you can get at the metal supplier, a full 24 foot stick. It's probably what they're gonna charge you for a five foot piece. So you definitely don't wanna go there. You need to get up here on your laptop, Google metal supplier, and see what comes up. And in my area, the main dealer here is gonna be Dillon's Supply Company. I don't know if you have one nearby. Uh, they're pretty good guys to work with. I like using them. That's just who we've always used. That's the main one to go to. Here in the center, I have my main cell phone I'm gonna call on. Uh, this is an older phone here. I don't know that the speaker on top of the camera is gonna pick up my speaker phone, so I'm gonna record off of this older cell phone. Number three is my notepad here. I'm gonna already have wrote down what I need to order, which we're going with inch and a half by inch and a half by one eighth angle. All right, so I already got it wrote down. If I get stumped, I just reference back to this. So, I got this pulled up on the laptop. Let's go ahead and make the phone call. Set audio to record. Let's dial this number. I already have it in here, so it will probably pop up since I deal with them so much, but I just wanted you to see the process that we're going through. Hey, how you doing? Doing alright. I need to get a, I need to get a cash ticket. Um, I was looking to see if you had any inch and a half by inch and a half by one eighth angle laying around. Uh, let me check. Only inch and a half I'm gonna have. I've got three pieces, twenty four foot long, maybe quarter inch thick. All right, what's the price on one of those? And you said it was under cash count. Yeah, it's just a cash ticket. 
sir. Uh, while you're in the system, can you also grab me a price for what it would be with the eighth inch thickness? On the inch and a half uh, quarter, okay. it would be 107.13 before tax. Inch and a half, one eighth, would be 56.51 before tax. For, for one stick? Yes, sir. 24 foot long. All right. So inch and a half by inch and a half by one eighth is 56.51. Mm -hmm. And then inch and a half by inch and a half quarter inch, 107. All right, so if I so to get to one eighth, how soon could you have some of that in? Uh, one eighth. I could have it next day. Around what time? Um, it always kind of varies. We like to say it'd be here by lunch, but I can't really guarantee it. All just kind of depends on how they set up the route. All right. Well, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and order the the inch and a half by inch and a half by one eighth. Let me order one okay. stick of that. Okay. All right. You putting this on a credit card or a debit card? Uh, yeah, credit card. Okay. And what's your first and last name? And what's the best number to call you when it comes in? And picking this up on the trailer, or do you need that cut in half? I'll pick it up on the trailer. Okay. All right. What uh, what type of card? Visa or? Visa. All right. And what's the billing zip code for that card? The billing zip code. All right. Card number? Card number. Yes, sir. Okay. The expiration? Expiration. All right. I've got it in for you, and uh, we'll give you a call as soon as it arrives tomorrow. All right, appreciate it. Yes, sir. Thank you. All right, bye bye. Whew, guys, metal is outrageous. Um, <laughs> I could have sworn the last time I bought a stick of that it was around thirty-five bucks, and he just quoted me fifty-six fifty-one. Man, that's crazy. All right, so that's taken care of. Uh, like I said, I got my phone down here doing the recording for me, so you probably hear the audio off of this. And I'm gonna speed up the parts where he was typing in the system. That took a while, so we'll probably you'll probably see some cuts, um, and we'll cut those out to speed this video up a little bit. And of course, the end where he was asking for all my card information, you definitely won't see that. But hey, that was step two of getting the metal order. So he said it will be in tomorrow. I'm off tomorrow also. I didn't want to go get it tomorrow. I wanted to get it today if all possible, but $107 for double the thickness and I didn't really need double the thickness and again I told you just a budget trailer for a buddy so we went with the 1 8 um, it's ordered to be in tomorrow hopefully in by lunch and we can go pick it up but I'm gonna take you along for part three of going to pick it up and it's gonna be interesting I don't know if you've ever seen a 24 foot stick on a 12 foot trailer so it's gonna be interesting anyway guys uh, we'll pick this back up tomorrow and and if you haven't already, remember, that red subscribe button in the corner, remember to click that, guys, and hit the little bell notification. It'll let you know when I post a new video. Guys, I need subscribers. Please help me out. Hit the little red subscribe button in the corner of the video or down on the actual page. Also, remember, thumbs up helps great. If you want to, you can put a thumbs down. All right, interaction is interaction, but a thumbs up would definitely be better. So, remember, subscribe, hit the thumbs up, and leave a comment down below let me know and we'll pick this back up tomorrow and catch you later.